Hi everybody, Holly Jacobs here. I promised I'd do a little better this year with the Cooks and Books. So today we're going to use the taco powder we made the other day and make a Mexican lasagna. It's super simple, you can switch the recipe up. My husband loves refried beans, so I use that. But you could use like whole black beans if you wanted. Um, so here we go. I'm going to show you the ingredients and we'll go from there. Flour tortillas. I cut them in half. Grated Colby Jack cheese. You could use cheddar or whatever kind you like. Um, some salsa. We're using refried beans. You could use any other kind of beans. And here is my taco meat that I made with our taco powder from the other day. I cut those tortillas into halves and quarters, which makes it really easy to layer as if they were lasagna noodles. Okay, there's the first layer, the tortillas, the refried beans, the meat, a little bit of salsa, and cheese. I split everything out half, made two layers, and then added one more layer of the tortillas, and just cheese on top. And that's it. I'm going to cover with foil, put it in the fridge, and pull it out for dinner. We have guests coming. So this is really easy. Everything's done. I'll start with a small salad, some salsa. We tend to use Greek yogurt instead of sour cream, but either would work. And dinner's done. So that's the easy one. I hope you'll check out my other videos and check out my books. Uh, that's how I earn my living. So you can find them at hollyjacobs.com online. Um, there's generally something new out. I hope you'll check them out and check back. There'll be more cooks and books this year. Thanks. P.S. I didn't mention baking it. Put it in the oven, 350. Because I use a glass pan, I put it in a cold oven and just turn it on. Uh, probably half hour, 45 minutes, depending if you're just making it and cooking it or making it, storing it, and then cooking it later. Um, just watch. If it's all bubbly on top, I take the foil off about the last 25 minutes. It's done. Have a good one.